Hey guys, how are you doing? This is Juliana. Welcome back. I hope everyone is doing a-okay. So yes, I am so excited for this video. It's month of October, Breast Cancer Awareness Month. I have a couple of friends who's been a survivor for a couple of years now and I count myself as one of them. It's been six years now since my multiple lumpectomy. I am so thankful that I was able to sit down here and do this video and I am so excited to share this uh, new babies in the market it was launched in October 6 and it is something like I love color pink and we are talking about the new collab of elf cosmetics with Nabila Noor as you can see these babies are so gorgeous and I love her. She's a true beauty. I got this uh, from elfcosmetics.com and it is now available at Ulta or Ulta.com. This is $35. The whole set, which is I really adore. I already use them. I don't know how to call this video, but it is something pink, something new, something old from Elf. So without further delay, let's dive into it. I already cleaned and moisturized my skin and we're going to dive into our primer. Next step, let's go with foundation and this one is the foundation serum from ELF. This is light shade and it's very light. You can see that it's it's liquidy. Of course, we're going to use the ELF beauty sponge. As you can see, it's so light. It's so sheer, so we have to double the layer. To build some coverage, I'm using this brush from the kit. This is the stippling brush. And you know what? It is so soft and I love it. So if you have a perfect skin, by all means, use this. If you have a lot of acne scars just like me, don't use this. Next up, let's work on our concealer and I'm using my all-time favorite concealer from ELF. This is the Kama Concealer, the 16-hour concealer. A little goes a long way. No, it's so light but we're going to bronze and contour okay now let's set our foundation and concealer this is one of my favorite setting powder from elf actually this is my third jar i used this up last time i went to philippines because it's so light So basically, I'm setting everything. To remove excess powder on my face, we're going to use this tapered powder brush from the kit. We're going to do our contour. We're going to use this tapered brush. This is one of ELF's classic pressed powder. They only have four shades from this line. And actually, I got this from Dollar Store last year. And I'm still using it. Eyebrows are done, contour and bronzing are done, and we're going to work on our eyeshadow. And we're going to use this a palette from ELF. This is one of my favorite palettes, and this is the opposites a track. I'm going to use this beigey fresh color here all over my eyelid. And I'm using this very teeny tiny brush here. So tiny though, especially if you're working on your on your whole eyelid you make sure that you fill up everything you know what the foundation is glowing so yeah I have to deal with it now let's move on with this color here so I'm going to use the lighter shade first I'm still using the same brush and just work on my crease 
I realized the more you dip in uh, from the palette, the more you cannot control the colors. So first dip, then blend everything, especially if the palette is pigmented. A little goes a long way. Our eyes are almost done, but right now I'm going to borrow this highlighter. This is the one from Elf with a Heart Defensor collaboration, and I'm going to use this color here the Coffee and Cream Highlighter Duo. I'm going to pack that color on my eyelid and blend it using my ring finger and for our lashes we're going to use this one from elf this is their lash kit it comes with tweezer and the adhesive so yes this is very dainty very portable especially if you're going out and you're traveling you don't want to bring a lot of things or stuff in your makeup bag this is very ideal so it comes with this little tiny adhesive that is so neat. Now let's work on our highlighter and I'm going to, you know what, before highlighter, why not blush? We're going to use this uh, blush primer from e.l.f. This is a very long lasting blush and we're going to use this uh, tapered brush here that we used earlier. You know what? The brush is not picking up my blush. Now let's move on with this highlighter. I'm so excited to use this. It's a loose highlighter so you just have to be careful. And I'm going to put a little on the lid. And we're going to test drive this first. Ooh! It's blinding. I don't know if you could see that it's so blinding so I have I just have to be careful using this use this brush swirl it a little goes a long way this is very pigmented I'm going to get a small amount here to work on my inner corner Now let's move on with our lips. Of course, I'm so excited to use this lip liner here. It's so nude, it's so neutral, which is I am so in love with. Finally, for our liquid lipstick, I'm using the shade Myra Nude. I hope you like our video for today. Thank you so much. Before you head out, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Ring that bell so you'll get notified on all my video uploads. And also, you can follow me on Instagram. The link is here. Thank you all so much. I love you guys. And I'll see you in my next video. Mwah.